Old Anaki here with another Halo 4 campaign mission walkthrough, and today I'm going to show you how to get the second of the two weekly campaign challenges for the week of November 18th through the 24th, which is Pinball, which requires you to complete any mission on heroic or higher difficulty with the Tilt Skull on. So for this uh, particular challenge, I chose a Dawn mission, and uh, there's a Tilt Skull, but in addition, I turned on Catch to get the Elites throwing grenades at me and the Grunt Birthday Party to make it easier to see uh, Grunt headshots from distance. So here we go, starting the uh, mission off. And we got to get through the 343 stuff. Which seems to take forever at times. But as we get into the real mission, go ahead and uh, skip this cutscene. Uh, the chief is slowly coming out of cryo sleep, thanks to Cortana. Where are we? And they're going to chit chat a little bit here, and she's going to turn on the artificial gravity and tell him to open up the uh, of the chamber, and we'll actually get started. You've been busy. Activating the ship's gravity generator. Okay, there goes the gravity. We gotta release this lever. Seems like old times. Ready to get back to work? I thought you never asked. And away we go. First thing we want to do is grab this pistol that fell down there. And just take off following this path. Off to the right. To the left. This little hallway here, a corridor, jump have? up, Four years, and to the left months, here, months. and all the way down to the end. Somebody should have found us by now. And the didact will scan us here with that That's nice orange color he is. And then that patterns. doorway will open and it'll go through here. The and to the closed elevator doors, use your select key Keep. to grab the doors and tap on it to open them up. Now when you get control back, uh, when the chief turns around, use your left thumb stick to climb. Uh, pushing it straight, will climb. you'll climb up. When he looks left, push your stick left. When he looks right, push your stick right. Alright, he looked right, and push your stick right again, and then just push it straight. And we're climbing. I'm sure everybody knows how to do this by now. Turn left and up. Go ahead and melee this uh, elite, because if you don't, he'll slice you in the gut and throw you off the side there. A lot can happen in four years. Okay, when we gain control back, there's a little, there's a pistol right there where you just run over it and ammo up, and through the doorway sprint and assassinate this elite. I use animation on there, and then we got eight grunts to take out. There's usually three that we can take out immediately on that side. There's four, there's five, six, seven, and I think I'll take the eighth out with an assassination or a melee. Yep, oh, he's down. Alright, swap out the useless AR for a plasma pistol. And I'm kind of getting my bearings here. There we go, back this way. Let's go ahead and ammo up on the pistol. There's an ammo crate on the other side as well. Alright, now I just swapped out the plasma pistol for one with more juice in it. Let's go ahead and open the blast shield doors. And head off to the left here. I'm going to move this container down here a ways. Uh, we're going to have two landing craft come in, or two fans with boarding tubes, each of which will have an elite and four grunts. Maybe the other But when they punch through the... Uh, the uh, observation deck uh, glass here, or whatever it is, plexiglass, it will create a partial vacuum and things will go flying to the wall like that. So, and what I'm doing here is I'm waiting for the elite to jump out. I jump, assassinate, and then I try to take out as many grunts as I can. It's one, that's two. Oop, missed him. I didn't want to get EMP'd there. There's three. 
There's four. And head back out to the other side of the doorway here. They will not follow you into this room. This is a good place to hide, get your shields back. Alright, five grunts down. Six grunts down, and it's a good place to take them on, because they will eventually come up to the doorway. And seven. Now, even with Tilt on, because Mythic's not on, you can, uh, and Thunderstorm, where you don't have major upgrades, you can noob combo the elites here. That's an EMP with the uh, plasma pistol, and then headshot. All right. And that was the eighth grunt I just took out. We've got bigger problems. Okay. We've got a cruiser on an I'm looking for a. Head for the elevator banks. Plasma pistol with more ammo, oh, and off to the elevator bank. There we go. Only the Hyperion missiles, but we'll have to fire them manually from the outer hole. Now next up we're going to have uh, an elite and a couple of grunts to take out. And we're going to take the elite out first with a noob combo. We're going to get the off this daggone elevator. Okay, finally. Alright. Start charging it up as this door opens. Aim over the grunts. Hit EMP the elite and head shooting. And then notice I immediately backed up here because a number of times what will happen is the grunts will go um, suicidal when you take the elite out first. That time they didn't. Alright, now we've got an elite and three grunts. Same idea here when this doorway opens. EMP the elite and then head shooting with it. Like that. Again, notice that one of those grunts went suicidal. Alright, that takes care of the grunts. I'm swapping out for a flesh, fresh plasma pistol. Now we've got an elite and four grunts. So each encounter is getting a little bit tougher here. Oh, missed him. Try again. Notice that he's throwing grenades at me, so he just kind of stands there. And that makes it a little bit easier to uh, take him with a uh, noob combo. Okay, a couple of them decided to go suicide on me with these grunts up here. I think that might, I don't know, one more maybe? There we go, there's the last one. Okay, all four grunts are down. And, jeez. I'm just trying to get a fresh plasma pistol, there we go. Alright, now we've got an elite, four grunts, and two shielded jackals. And we're going to save the jackals for the end. Go ahead and take out as many of these grunts as you can from distance. Once you start taking them out, they will move around that box back towards you a little bit. Okay, the grunts are down. Now we're going to take on the elite. Go ahead and ammo up here. And step out from behind this big crate. And EMP. Headshot. He's done. Immediately come back behind the crate. I'm going to use that as cover on the uh, two jackals. They will come through these uh, doorways here. And that was pretty easy. He kind of left his head wide open there. He, he, he doesn't see me. There we go. Sometimes that's a little tougher. By the way, if you EMP uh, the shield, it will knock them back and pre present their heads for a headshot. So that's something to remember. I didn't have to do it there, but that's one way you can get the shield of jackals. We're just about there. Alright, now we've got eight grunts, two shielded jackals, and three elites to deal with. Now this time we're going to take out the shielded jackals first. They're out here on the wings. So ease around so you just see them, and go ahead and head shoot them before they can drop their shields for protection. Alright, then we got to deal with the grunts. Probably have a bunch more coming in that far doorway. I think there might be one or two more left. Yeah, let's see. Yep, yeah, that's probably it for the grunts. Alright, now we're going to take out one of the elites with a noob combo. 
You notice uh, when they're throwing grenades at you, they're just kind of standing there still. So all you got to do is sidestep the grenade and EMP them and then head shoot them. Fairly simple to, uh, technique. There's number two. Now number three is a concussion rifle uh, elite. And he is uh, down in the in the room in the hallway that we want to go through. So what I'm going to do here is just pound on the window. You advance to a certain point in this room and he will come out. But by doing it that way, you know where he's at. Oh, and he is down. Okay, off to the outside, to the missile. Alright, now, what they would want you to do is come out here, turn left, and engage a bunch of coveys to fight your way to the missile launch key. And then launch it, and then fight your way back through a whole bunch more coveys to get to the jammed uh, missile. But we're going to do a little skip called the backdoor skip. We're going to run around to the right here. And this by bypasses all the initial coveys that are lined up along the left and it keeps the uh, phantoms from coming in and dropping off even more Chief, you need to find the missile controls. all right it is a little dark back here but there are some uh, broken beams and such that we're going to climb up on or jump up on oops missed the first time you can hardly see them all right there we go jump jump again and get in underneath Kind of back up this slanted piece here. Jump up on this inverted T-beam. Walk down to it right about here. All right, do a crouch jump up, holding the crouch. Because if you don't hold the crouch, you won't make it. And run over and hit the la missile launch control launch key. And immediately jump out because the darn thing's jammed. The, uh, the blast doors are jammed and we have to unjam them. And we've got a phantom coming in. It's getting ready to fire at us, that cruiser. Actually, the cruiser's coming in, so. Go ahead and unjam the doors. You can see the cruiser firing at us. And we're almost done. The missile's going to launch and take out the cruiser. Of course, the Didac is scanning us now with his nice orange color. The cover the one scanning us. The chief knows it's not the Cubbies. So, now can we worry about the giant metal right. planet? As soon as we gain control, turn around and run back this way. Well uh, you'll see a waypoint light up. That's the doorway we need to go through. There it is. There's the waypoint. Where are the closest escape pods? Aft vehicle bay. And we gotta wait and wait and wait. I don't know if anybody's noticed, but there's uh, etched in the doorway. There's a nice little goblin face. I, I can hardly see it, but uh, here it is. Looks like all the doorways on uh, Ford and Don have those uh, goblin faces. Okay, stop here for a second. Let that explosion occur, and then run through here. Back through here. Stop here. Let everything fall down. All right, go jump down through here to the next room. Do the same thing, just stop for a second. Let everything blow up, and then you can pick your path out. Run through here. I'm going to do a sprint jump across here. All right, and run down this corridor, and you know, I decided to take that guy out. You don't have to. They're not going to bother you. They're all freaking out, all the cubbies. Do the doorway, and that's essentially the mission. We're going into a, uh, a cutscene here where we're caught in a gravity well, and we're going to be um, falling uh, along with all the wreckage. But that's essentially the mission. Uh, that'll get you the challenge. Uh, pinball with uh, Tilt Skull on. As we Watch the chief fall down, fall through. The uh, end of mission symbols will pop, uh, go, come up here in a second after the Halo 4. And then the challenge will pop, and that should do it. Uh, 
I hope this helps you in uh, your quest for the uh, weekly challenge of pinball. Uh, this is Old Anaki uh, signing off. Take care, everybody.